Hello my precious cinnamon rolls, my name is Fofo and I'm here back again playing Hellblade and I want to apologise for it being such a long time since I recorded Hellblade uh, I've run out, I've run out of energy by the time I get to Friday so I'm doing a recording on Saturday today instead We're still uh, Delian! collecting the fragments of the sword if I remember correctly Dillian never much cared for the underworld. I looked dimly upon the druids, like her father, Zinbath. I guess he took after his father. The chieftain who oh believed nothing he couldn't see. <laughs> okay. Try that again then. Adelian! <laughs> this is a little too real for me. <laughs> Still have a lot of problems with heights. Don't bother me so much anymore. But you're going to fall, careful. No, she's not. She's not going to fall. She's strong. She's steady. She can do it. You can do it, Sin. <sighs> I'm not doing it quicker. No. No, absolutely not quicker. <laughs> Blackness, it's all it's kind of blobbing around. <laughs> Be very, very careful. No, <laughs> I'd noticed it's narrow, thank you. <laughs> Nearly there. Oh no! Oh dear. You're going to fall, Kev. No, she's not. She's not going to fall. She's strong. <laughs> you can do it, Sim. Hey, Dillian, come give us a hug. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen. <laughs> no! no. Oh! Just got an achievement. Your father cannot understand your darkness. He cannot see through your eyes. No one can. My own father was born blind. Doesn't have the faintest idea of what the night looks like. The word dark to him means as little as the word light. So someone is afraid of the dark. So we fixed them by taking away their sight. This is a hidden loading screen, isn't it? <laughs> well, that's a really interesting ear. <laughs> so we've done that one. I think fraps in this game don't get on very well. I think that's a known thing. So the frame rate is kind of bibbity bobbiting. Oh, on the bottom of the lovely briny sea, whatever that friggin' song goes. <laughs> right, we've got another one over there. It's still blue, so we'll get that one. Shit. 
time? I saw once a plague strike northern lands of ice. It was so terrible that not the oldest man among us could remember the like. Hundreds died. The sickness took nearly every person younger than forty and many older. And where dying mothers gave birth, the marks of the plague were on the babes as they oh came out of the womb. I wonder why I didn't kill the older people. Loading screen. <laughs> Any minute now. Where are we? I don't like it. This place feels. It doesn't. What is this place? It's creepy. Creepy. It feels wrong. It feels strange. It's a swamp or something. Yeah, are there, you can hallucinate smells just as you can hallucinate um, oral things and um, oral things. Just as you can hallucinate, you know, visually and auditory, you can hallucinate smell. It's just rarer. Fix it. You have to fix it. Now you have to find him. Quick, get to the house. So we we'll need house. an archway, I think. It doesn't finish until you get to the house. Before he disappears, Noir, you have to get in. There's an archway. When I was having my psychotic episode, I uh, could smell blood. It was not pleasant, to say the least. What's different for that one? It didn't look any different. Oh, there's a ladder there. Oh wait, it doesn't hit, reach the ground. Okay, never mind. Let's go have a look, see at it. Ah, uh, maybe that's what we need to do.
How do we get there? <laughs> I think we have to go back round, all the way around to see that. Okay. No, let's go right round first. Gross. <laughs> things grosser than stagnant pond you know algae and manky things and deadness in it but uh, I wouldn't want to wait for anything that was worse <laughs> either no dead end okay Go back to that first arch wagon. All the dead bodies, okay. Alright, so I don't think we can get through if again if we do that. No, we can't. Okay. To go back again. That ladder then. <laughs> I can't duck under that, okay. Obviously missing something, but <sighs> how do we get there? There's this rooty thing. I think maybe we have to put that tree back up with some archway, but... I know that we're supposed to be mending the bridge, that's obvious, but... How do we get to that ladder? <laughs> Just 
just go and do change the things around and then uh, see if we can get there with the without the ladder up down whatever let's see if I'm missing I'm doing this in the wrong order and that's why I'm getting confused okay so ah there we go All right <laughs> Northmen speak of a death moon, a light shaped like a half moon that appears inside a house and goes around the walls. I once saw the death moon appear at a farm, and first the shepherd dies, then a guest dies, and then the farmhands, and then the farmer and six of his men drown in sea. That's how you do it, right? Because the dead return to haunt the living. If you see the death moon. And beware, because there will be death in that house. Well, he's just a barrel of fun, isn't he? <laughs> okay, now what? <laughs> ah, the controller vibrated, so... <laughs> you passed the trial, get to the house. You succeeded. I think Senua needs a nice warm bath <sighs> and a big fluffy blanket. Oh dear, that's not good. That's all monkey. I'm gonna go a little bit further, I think. Genoa, come to me. Where are you? I'm here. I'm right here. Are you in there? I have to come find out if you are. Focus. There was a Northman called Grettir. Big, red haired, immensely strong. But he was afraid of the dark. Focus now. <laughs> They're coming for me. Oh dear. Well, I didn't mean to interrupt that um runestone, but Totally different place now. Are we being chased? Or do we think we're being chased? I don't know. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> Alright, oh, we're looking for Dillion in the through the maze. Right, okay, I got it. He's showing us where the rooms are. Right. Mm. The light. The room. Go towards it. Focus. I have to find one more. One dance. Come on, come on. Where is he? What shall I do? You've got them. Oh dear. <laughs> it's going all grainy. I think it was over the that way.
the back to the first room. Good. So the door should be. Yeah. <laughs> Achievement. <laughs> oh, this is a flashback because she's got no paint on. Senua. Sanoa, what happened? They're blaming me for the plague. They say that I'm cursed. What if they're right? How would they know such a thing? Are they gods? None of us are. They're just people. Good people, but they're scared. They're afraid of what they can't see. Like children scared of the dark. They make up stories to fill the void. That doesn't make them true. What if my father was right? You have to step out of this darkness. Let them see who you really are like I am. You know, the dialogue's out of sync. I don't think there's anything I can do with that, about that. Without you, the darkness has made me a monster. Killing you would be too easy. They're taking your memories to torture you. They're taking you to the inside. You're disappearing. Could we get them all? See any more shards that are blue? Dillian gave her the strength to pass the warrior trials, and she saw a way out to leave her past behind and become a warrior in Dillian's clan. Go back, go back, go back, go back. The sword is tainted by the gods of darkness. Leave it. No. He left it here. He wants me to take it. You will pay a price for this. Oh dear. <laughs> but years later, with Zinbal's parting words still haunting her, the darkness came back with a vengeance. The plague. Do you? Everyone suffered. My father was not supposed to die like this. Do you see it clearly now, Senua? The suffering you've caused. This is your fault. You brought this plague to us. You have blood on your hands. And I'm going to end this episode here when, uh, when we get out of the cutscene. Hold your heavy strike. Hold it. Hold the heavy strike. Hold it. Hold, your Hold it. Strike. Hold your heavy strike. Unleash the sword. 
Okay. End of episode. There go.